Hi guys, Ken here. Uh, postcards from Cebu. I'm uh, recovering from some serious jet lag. <laughs> I, uh, I left uh, Washington DC uh, local time. Actually when I, 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 I got up at 7 a.m. and uh, worked for most of the day. Left around 1 uh, in the afternoon. My son came home and gave me a ride to um, uh, Dulles International Airport and uh, left from Dulles and flew to Boston and then had a five-hour layover in Boston to catch the uh, Cathay Pacific flight um, to uh, Hong Kong. So we flew up, and this is the first time I've done this, but we flew up over the North Pole, or the Arctic Circle anyway, maybe not exactly the North Pole, but basically flew up over the north, northern end of the planet and then down through Russia and China and landed in Hong Kong. So that was kind of a, kind of an interesting trip. Uh, then I had a couple hour layover in Hong Kong uh, to catch my flight from Hong Kong to Cebu. And I landed uh, yesterday uh, at about 11.30 in the afternoon and my stepchildren uh, had a wake and, and uh, uh, final service at the uh, final mass at, at the church in Minglanilia for Vivian's remains. So I got back, I brought the ashes, uh, and we did a mass at 5 p.m. and a wake right after that, after some uh, novena prayers, novena, novena. And uh, then we did the wake. And finally, uh, by the time I got to sleep uh, last night, I was up uh, about 48 hours straight because I can't sleep on the airplanes. I, I don't know. I'll doze off for a little bit, but then I'll wake right back up. And so basically I went 48 hours without any sleep. So I crashed pretty hard last night. And uh, today I'm feeling a little better, but I'm still jet lagging. So I'm not out and about, just ran down to the 7-Eleven uh, downstairs and got some uh, snacks. And um, Otherwise, I'm just going to chill out here. Has some work to do. So I was on my computer earlier doing some work and getting that stuff done. Um, I'm thinking about having, uh, I think, well, I'm, I'm going to do this. I'm going to, uh, on Saturday, I think it's December 2nd, uh, I'm going to, I'm just going to hang out over at Ayala Mall here in Cebu City for a couple of hours at the Starbucks, say around 10 a.m. And anybody who wants to come meet me in person, if you're here in Cebu City, uh, stop on by, say hi. Um, I'd love to see you. Uh, so many of uh, subscribers and viewers are very friendly. So if you're here in Cebu City, Saturday, December 2nd, uh, stop by uh, the Starbucks in Ayala Mall, and I will be hanging out there and be happy to chat with you in person. Uh, in the meantime, um, let me give you a view uh, out of the hotel window here of the skyline in Cebu, kind of over that way. that direction you can kind of see uh, the Cebu Strait and the ports and everything are over there then in this direction pretty much facing south you see the hills okay so that would have been the east and now we're facing south and now we're starting to turn to the west obviously my room is on the south side of this building and uh, so that's an idea of what Cebu City looks like. Uh, not the best skyline from my view, but it's working just fine. Uh, my stepchildren did an amazing job, absolutely amazing, putting together the, uh, the wake. It was really uh, wonderful. Uh, uh, Shami, uh, Shara, my stepdaughter, uh, was an amazing coordinator. And uh, CJ, um, is a chef, a very good chef, and he prepared all the food. It was absolutely wonderful. And uh, Christian uh, was my best helper at uh, moving things around and getting things in place and carrying luggage and all that kind of stuff. So it was uh, it was truly a delightful evening, although I was totally burnt out from being awake so long and traveling so far. Anyway, guys, uh, yeah, a couple of you asked me to keep uh, the videos coming. I plan to do that 
Um, next week I'm going to be taking a fishing trip over to Sierra Gal um, Island and uh, I'll certainly get some footage of that and uh, if I'm feeling better tomorrow I'll get out and about in Cebu City a little bit and uh, you know, uh, show you around although there's plenty of people online doing that so uh, anyway guys um, like and share this video um, Feel free to donate to the Go Com uh, <laughs> GoFundMe campaign. Uh, there's a link in the description section below. And like always, guys, up there is going to be Vivian's pretty face. Click on it. Join us. Subscribe to the channel. We'd love to have you with us. Thanks so much for watching, guys. Bye. Mm -hmm.